My name is Kit Downs, I'm a pianist and organist and I've been working with Oldborough Music for maybe five years, something like this. We took part in the Open Space Scheme a while ago, um, myself and Tom Challenger, who's a saxophone player that I work with a lot. And we uh, constructed a project about regional organs in various states of disrepair. It was like a field recording project where we went around documenting extended techniques on different instruments, all of different sizes, different ages and different strengths and weaknesses. And then uh, made a collage of those field recordings and made them into a record called Viamanical. And then we did a live performance of that involving vintage buses for the Oldborough Festival that same year. Since then, um, we've gone on to make a few different records for the label ECM, and the first of which was a solo record that I made uh, where I used some of the same organs that we'd used for the Obra project. Um, St. John the Baptist and Snape, we used that organ. And then uh, this second record for ECM with Tom on again, and also with Lucy Railton on cello and Seb Brochford on drums, who will be playing with me um, this afternoon. Uh, that's called The Dream Life of Debris, and that's uh, a continuation musically from the last two records, The Viomanical, which was the project for Auburn, and Obsidian, which was the solo record I made after that. So it all has its roots in the, the work that was developed here four years ago, I think, something like this, with uh, Tom through the Open Space program. sung a lot of Benjamin Britten when I was a chorister at Norwich Cathedral and that felt like a strong connection in some ways and I've been to see concerts here when I was young so I always knew about um, snake maltings and, and what happened here. I wanted to work um, without having the pressure of it having to be chronicled live so often so not having to do so many concerts and gigs but really working in a more residential slower pace and be a bit more thorough as well in our research. It's also quite a bonkers project, so I'm really grateful that uh, Rebecca and Snape were up for making it happen, and especially putting it as part of the festival as well, and doing this organ crawl idea. It was, um, you know, not many people are that open-minded and willing to give you that much, um, willing to take such a risk in it, because we're improvisers as well, a lot of it isn't, we can't show a score of what it's going to sound like before the concert, you know. <laughs> All we can do is play the way that we play in that moment. And so there is a, there's a certain degree of trust that has to be there. And we're very grateful that we were given it, especially over such a long period. Mm -hmm. 